I was going through uh, transferring files to my laptop and came across this which you may find of some use. It will allow you to calculate odds based on the ratings and the various different ratings. Uh, there are instructions on the sheet uh, which are here but I will run through it quickly with you. Um, this is the page for calculating odds. So let's look at today's <coughs> card. Excuse me. Uh, let's pick a race that's got all the horses rated. Here we are. The 250 Utoxeter. So the first thing I'm going to do is copy the horse data across to the sheet. There's those in. Then I'm going to copy the ratings across to the sheet. Um, just for the sake of ease, we will use the master rating. Let's copy those in. Now we need a standard deviation number. And this is based on the highest and lowest rating. So you've got 2644 for the highest and 1688 for the lowest. So if we go to the next tab and enter in there 2644. And then in the bottom figure, 1688. You'll need to click here because for some reason it doesn't work unless you do. That gives us a standard deviation of 169. So if we put that into here, click the standard SD, that will then give us this sheet, click calculate, and there are the odds based on the rating. Looking at that, on foi has got no chance at all. Um, if you're looking for place ratings or place odds, uh, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, there's eight horses, so we can go to the first three places. Um, so we'll tick the first three, click calculate, and there are our place odds based on the master rating. Um, you can do this with any rating at all. We could change that rating to, let's have a look, uh, let's do it on the MSC. Let's copy those, put them in. Now again we need a standard deviation, so we've got 67 for the highest and 14 for the lowest. So let's change these figures. That gives us 9.4. So if we go back to the race data, and then click Calculate. And you can see the odds have changed. Uh, looking at the winner's odds, we've got Sauté at 2.21. Hopefully this gives you the gist of it. Uh, this is shown as a printout on the final page. So that gives you an idea of what you can do. So you can base it around any odds that you want to, uh, any rating, sorry, that you want to, and work out the odds based on that particular rating. You also have a margin for, uh, if you like, a value back and a value odd. You can change the uh, percentages that you're looking at. So that you've got a 10% margin or minus 5% to give you value odds based around that particular rating. Hopefully this is helpful to you uh, and you can find some use from it. It is one of a series of bits and pieces that I'll be putting up over the next few weeks to assist you in various betting areas, uh, including staking plans, etc. and various other things.